Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's December. It is the first of December. And you better believe I'm already here at a festive cocktail. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I am absolutely bamboozled at the fact that it is December already. Like, where has the year gone? Am I right? Crazy. Um, but I'm here for it. It's the first of December. I'm here for all the Christmas festivities, all the Christmas drinks, cocktails. And I'm here with a fantastic one to start off your December. This is a Burrow Festive Flip. So excited for this one. I'm using two powerhouse liqueurs in my bar that I absolutely love. So one of them is the Sheepdog Peanut Butter Whiskey. Um, is it whiskey liqueur? Yeah, whiskey liqueur, um, 35%. Fantastic. Love it, love it, love it. Um, and my second one is my love, the love of my life, the Fraser's um, Blended Scotch Whiskey Liqueur. And it's strawberry flavoured. It's just unreal. So the flavours I'm kind of going for is like peanut butter and strawberry. So yeah, I mean, that's a classic, right? And I've just decided that it's, it is Christmassy. That that's, that's why I say so. <laughs> no, it's because it's a flip and I always feel like flips are dead Christmassy. So in a flip is egg yolk. So I am using egg yolk in this cocktail as well. Not egg white, egg yolk. Um, and that's what makes the flip part. Uh, so I'm also using salted caramel milk. What? <laughs> salted caramel syrup. And I, I was going to use a spoon of strawberry jam to make it this sort of strawberry peanut butter thing, but I didn't have it. So I've got bramble jam. So we're going to go and see how it goes with the bramble jam. But um, yeah, so that is all of the ingredients for this cocktail. Let's get it in the shaker, get it shaken and get it drank. And I can tell you what it tastes like. So in my shaker, I'm going to start with the, the peanut butter whiskey. So I'm going to do 35 mils of that in the shaker. This is just glorious. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. Um, add it to a little bit of whiskey and, you know, make an old fashioned out of it. It just gives that extra sweetness. And yeah, it's delicious. Um, my lovely Fraser's strawberry whiskey as well. I'm going to do the same amount in here. Um, they're both kind of similar in strength. So in fact, are they? Or am I talking rubbish? Uh, no, they are actually. Well, this is 27% and that's 35. But they, yeah, they kind of taste, they're both liqueur, so they're not overly strong. Um, so it's going to be quite a sweet drink. It's definitely not going to be too strong and overpowering like a really, one of my really strong drinks. Um, okay, that is both of them in there. We're going to go with the salted caramel milk, which I didn't even know was a thing until I saw it in the supermarket and was like, wow, <laughs> I need to use that in a cocktail. Um, so I'm going to go in with 45 mils. Of the milk. Lovely. And then salted caramel syrup, I'm just going to do 15 mils of that. Um, because I think this can be yeah, a little bit overpowering if you use if you use too much. There. And then just a little spoon of the jam. Whatever jam you have, I would say strawberry jam, but I'm not even using the strawberry jam almost one full spoon, teaspoon of jam in there. And then my egg yolk, I have cracked off camera. So you don't want to watch me doing that. So I've just got an egg yolk in here. So you just plop that in as well. I know this seems weird. I know it does. Um, but you just got to trust me. If you've never had a flip before, it just, it's so creamy and so delicious and so festive. Like I really do. Yeah, I think it's very, very Christmassy and it tastes delicious. It gives it a really nice, um, sort of mouthfeel, really nice and creamy, and I think it's gonna really work. I've done a few flips before with milk, so I think it's gonna work really well. So add the ice and just give that a really good shake. And you do want to give it, same with an egg, if you're adding egg white, you want to, you know, like really shake your cocktail to froth up. This isn't gonna froth up, but you just want to disperse that egg yolk and just make sure that it's nice and creamy and yeah, not wonky. I'm gonna strain it anyway, but. Okay, my hand's getting very cold, so <laughs> that's gonna do me. Okay, um, for my garnish, <laughs> I've just got a little bit of um, candy cane because I actually, it is the 1st of December, and I'm actually not quite there yet with all my Christmas preps. I don't have a huge amount of Christmassy garnishes for my cocktails, but I think this looks pretty cute, and that's kind of a nod to Christmas, right? So, okay, get your strainer and just strain this in here. I'm 
Lovely. Oh my goodness. It's perfect. She says before even drinking it. <laughs> but there we go. That is the Burrow Festive Flip. So let's give this a little taste, shall we? Cheers. Mmm, so creamy. And actually, more sort of alcoholic tasting than what I was expecting. I thought it was going to be really sweet because it's two liqueurs. Mm. I mean, delicious. I would definitely opt for that over a dessert any day. 100%, obviously booze instead instead of desserts <laughs> but no that is like a really nice desserty cocktail though to finish a sort of a nice heavy meal you know if you have quite a lot to eat and you're like I don't want a, a pudding but what I do want is something sweet that is perfect so festive as well you definitely get away with serving that to guests if they're coming over around the festive season and um, I think everyone will love that People might be a bit squeamish about the egg yolk, but you know, if you're getting eggs that are in the supermarket that are sort of tested and whatnot, then it's the same as using egg whites, do you know? It's, yeah, it's raw egg, but it's the same thing. So um, I love it. I love a flip. I love the Burrow Festive flip, and I hope you do as well. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching me on the Burrow Home Bar. Um, happy December, and look forward to lots more Christmassy festive cocktail videos from me. Cheers.